Mendoza, a name that conjures visions of sunlit vineyards set against the towering Andes. Nestled in the heart of Argentina's wine country, this city offers an unforgettable mix of scenic beauty and thrilling activities, drawing in adventurers, wine lovers and everyone in between. It's a place you'll want to return to no matter the season, for the perfect blend of outdoor fun, culture, and of course world-class wine. Ready to discover the top 10 must-do activities that make this city a true gem? Let's get started! First up, we're heading to Bodega Salentine in the Uco Valley. Just an hour from Mendoza, this vast estate sprawls across 12,400 acres of vineyards. On a guided tour, stroll through the vineyards, learn about European winemaking techniques, and discover the secrets of their renowned Argentinian wines. Don't forget to try their Gran Uco blend and a Malbec from the Kilka range. It's a true treat for wine lovers. Next, let's venture to the historic Bodega Trapiche in the Maipu Valley. Established in 1883, this winery is a cornerstone of Mendoza's wine culture. On your visit, explore the vineyards, learn about the winemaking process with a behind-the-scenes tour, and indulge in a tasting session. With a range of award-winning Malbecs and other varietals like Chardonnay and Syrah, your taste buds are in for a delightful journey. Now, we're off to Aconcagua Provincial Park home to the tallest mountain in the Americas. The views here are simply stunning, with rugged valleys and glacial lagoons set against the backdrop of the Andes. While scaling Aconcagua is for the pros, there are plenty of shorter hikes to enjoy. The 10-mile trek to Confluencia offers sweeping vistas, or opt for a more relaxed walk to the Hawcones Lagoon. Remember to dress warmly, this high-altitude park can get quite windy and chilly. Next, Embrace the great outdoors in Potro Rios, a scenic town known for its artificial lake. Surrounded by snow-capped mountains, Potro Rios offers a range of activities from rafting and kayaking to horseback riding and mountain biking. The lake, created by a dam on the Mendoza River, is perfect for water sports, while the surrounding area invites you to trek, zipline, or even try paragliding. A short drive from downtown Mendoza brings us to Cerro de la Gloria, this iconic hill, crowned with the impressive national monument to the Army of the Andes, offers panoramic views of the city and the surrounding mountains. You can either hike up or take a taxi to the top, where you can enjoy a coffee and soak in the breathtaking views. The monument itself, a tribute to Argentina's liberators, is a sight to behold. Next, visit Plaza Independencia, the beating heart of Mendoza. This vibrant square is perfect for people watching, enjoying live music, or exploring artisan markets. It's a must-visit spot with dancing water fountains and a lively atmosphere, especially in the evenings. Spend the day wandering through them, savoring local cuisine, and soaking in the local vibe. Next, unwind at Cachuta Thermal Baths, nestled in the Precordillera area just 40 kilometers from Mendoza. It's the perfect spot to relax and rejuvenate. The complex also offers a grotto sauna, and a restaurant serving delicious Argentine cuisine. A day here is a soothing escape. Just be sure to visit during the week to avoid the crowds. Next, visit San Martin Park, Mendoza's great green escape. This expansive park, designed in the late 19th century, is a haven for nature lovers and families alike. Stroll along the picturesque walkways, enjoy a picnic, ride a bike, or relax by the lake. The park also hosts the annual National Grape Harvest Festival, a celebration of Mendoza's wine culture. Next on our adventure, we visit the Mendoza River, a hidden gem in Argentina for thrill-seekers. While Mendoza is famed for its wine, it's also home to some of the world's best whitewater rafting. A full-day tour lets you conquer a thrilling 12-kilometer stretch of rapids, with the chance to lead the raft in the splash zone. Finally, we visit the breathtaking Puente del Inca, a natural colorful bridge in the Andes near Mendoza. This UNESCO World Heritage Site wasn't built by the Incas, but was sculpted by glacial melt, with its stunning yellow and ochre hues coming from mineral-rich hot springs. While it's no longer safe to cross, you can still marvel at this unique formation while exploring nearby Aconcagua National Park. That's it for this episode of our Mendoza tour. Which other city would you like us to cover next? Let's engage in the comments. Please like, share and subscribe to our channel. Until next time, keep adventuring and discovering, and we'll see you in the next one.